Detective Comics 1000 comes out this week. So why is it not on our list? And welcome back to the channel, everybody. I'm Brant. I'm Lisa. And this is Brant vs. Lisa, Most Anticipated. We're talking about our favorite comics coming out on March 27th. Mm -hmm. Big Detective Comics 1000 day. I'm just going to keep hammering that in. He's making fun of me. <laughs> okay, so Detective Comics 1000 is, of course, my most anticipated just because of the epicness of that achievement, right? I know some people are a little iffy $10 book and all that <laughs> stuff. But anyway, it's not on our list because it's a $10 book and it's like 80 pages or whatever. And I don't want to read 80 pages. I can't subject her to that. <laughs> you know, she's trying to get back in. And I'm like, here's 80 pages of Batman. Random stories by multiple creators. Go for it. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not going to do that to her, so... And I might read it, but just not that fast. I can't right. read it that quickly. Yeah. And four more books. Yeah, we like to stay to the single issues as much as we can. Sometimes we do back issues because we have to catch up on certain things and yeah. stuff like that. But we even try to limit that, so... Okay. Keep it fair and, and keep it moving and so we can do these videos on time. Yeah. So, anyway... <laughs> <laughs> since that is not on our most anticipated list, I wonder what is. Who's first? I'll go first. Why not? Okay. <laughs> All right. So the book that I wanted to read is Glow, issue number one from IDW. I love the show. It's like a tribute to my childhood watching Glow, uh, actual Glow wrestling, gorgeous ladies of wrestling. If anybody doesn't know, isn't aware, Allison Breeze on the the show on Netflix right now. It's it's a solid show. So. I want to read that. So now you have to too. Yes, I do. <laughs> I watched one episode. <laughs> and so, nope, you can have it. And I, I took it. So, but anyway, now you get to read it in comic book form. Yes, I do. All right. So, what did you pick? I picked for you to read. No, no just what you wanted. That's what I led with. Oh, right. Shazam. You issue four. Shazam. Yeah, this is issue four. I yeah, I liked it. We were. I had to catch up for our previous anticipated week yep. so i'm all caught up and i want to see what happens with yeah. all that it'll be a nice precursor to the movie because that'll be the next movie we go and see that is true so that'd be awesome we just saw we, captain marvel yeah we saw one captain marvel now we'll go see the other one <laughs> yeah and uh yeah so that, that that should be fun and i love that series too so that's mm -hmm. good all right so the one i wanted you to read because i'm kind of excited about it and i've heard good things about it dial h for hero issue number one yeah. new comic from dc reviving an old concept and old property um friends of ours have read it and they've said it's really good and now i'm curious i'm excited and i want to share that with you so hopefully we both like it yeah i hope so and my second one hopefully you'll like it too mm. is uh you might you liked the last i did one. i did uh the new marvel rising yeah so, so. that's it's funny because we were talking about squirrel girl on mm. frontline live last week and we were like oh. Uh, Chris was like, who's even reading Squirrel Girl? And I was like, Marvel Rising, dude. There's more Squirrel Girl <laughs> merchandise in the store than there is Captain Marvel. What are you talking about? <laughs> well, at least in our store. In our store, yeah, that's the case. So it's it's yeah. weird, but yeah, it's yeah. So definitely, there's a there's a fan base. But I did enjoy it. I I enjoyed more the Miss Marvel side than the Squirrel, Squirrel Girl. Girl side, just because. All that dialogue in the in the gutters and stuff it just I, it drives me crazy I don't I never read it or if I try to read it, it's like it takes me completely out but anyway yeah. whatever it's still fun it was a fun series that last one with right. the with the girl that had the video game powers or whatever mm. I like that one so all right so the book that we picked together is another new number one another kind of reboot a new yeah. take on a character which is Sabrina the teenage witch issue number one from Archie yeah. Which I hope is better than the Netflix show. Because I watched <laughs> one, maybe two. Maybe two. Episodes of the Netflix show and, and I, I gave got, up. <laughs> and I got bored and went back and watched the entire season. Yeah. And yeah, I gave up after that. It so. sucks too because I really like, um, oh, I forgot his name. Who? He played Jeff in, <laughs> in uh, oh, um, uh, and Coupling. Coupling. The... the I forget his character, but he's like the the headmaster of the of the school. Yeah. In Sabrina, yeah. It was just too sinister. 
for me. It was too satanic for me. <laughs> but, that you know, was my way of saying that. <laughs> I'm just going to put it right out there. It was, it was just a little too far for me. Hello, Rainy. So I hope Rainy's you guys like this a little better. The new book. Yeah. And like you, mm-hmm. just like curled up in the corner on my foot. Yeah. Um, <laughs> anyway, so yeah, that's our that's our pick, and that's our all our picks. Yeah, and we're, we're excited. Yeah, there's mm-hmm. there are several other books I'm excited about coming out this yeah, week. Yeah, there were a few more I'll probably read. Detective Comics being one of them. It was like when we were going through them, I was like, oh, Amazing Spider-Man, that's a maybe. Oh, this mm-hmm. this new one from Dark Horse, that's a maybe. But we settled on these five. Yeah. And, I might yeah. even read the next Spider-Man. I hope you do. I hope you continue at least this arc. Yeah, because I need to figure out who all those characters are. There you go. <laughs> That's one way to do it. I'm going to get that black cat very okay. cool. Okay. Okay. We're fine. good with that. All right. Hang so. it in your Spider-Man corner. Yeah. That's cool with my Mary Teens. <laughs> yeah. um. <laughs> <laughs> all right so that's gonna wrap this one up if you like the video please give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe and notification bell so you get updates on all the content going up to the channel and by the way i, we, I did a live edition of monday musings yesterday we had just gotten out of captain marvel lisa made an appearance so go check that out but other than that you can follow me at brent fowler on facebook and twitter follow both of us at lastenberg press and little victories yt on instagram New contest starting next week. Yes, and it's a good one. Yes, it is. It's a it's good a comic good. theme. Book. Yeah, it's speaking of Spider Man. <laughs> really good. Check it out. April 1st. <laughs> Little Victories. YT on YouTube. Take care, everybody. <laughs> Bye.